You're jingling, jingling. Come get your ice cream before I kick you and your dinglings. It's the twins, baby, and we're feeling mighty diabolical. Any Decepticons that try us better submit and sucker popsicles. Oh, my flood, that's a bar right there, bro. That's what I'm talking about. The streets gonna love this one, bro, man. I can't wait to find sideways and bend them over for the team. Nah, facts. Yo, I was thinking, though. Hear me up before you start complaining. But I was thinking about probably scanning another alt mode or something. Matter of fact, we need to transform into a Hellcat, dog. The hoes finna love this. They ain't ready for it. Bro, that's real, but low-key, I think we're coolin'. Nobody expects two robots whipping it at the same time we gotta stay unpredictable out here never let your ops know your next move you feel me we're all right all right i'm with you yo but we do gotta find sideways like right now though bro could be anywhere for real for real i'm just saying that we'll keep a lookout bro on god a few moments later yo mudflap is that sideways nah hold on it is yes sir bro let's go f him up yeah uh, kids what are you doing whoa hold on bro ow Ah, I hope none of the Tinder shawties saw this, man. It got tragic, new paddock. Man, what the f***? I told her we should have gotten a Hellcat. Now you got us out here looking goofy, bruh. <laughs> Ow! Ladies, gentlemen, brothers and sisters, humans of all races and ages, man. What's good? Shout out to you for pulling up on this Izzy Man Diaz video, bro. Hope you're doing well, man. It's all I love over here. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, though. Today's episode might be a little on the spicy and divisive side of things. You see, I'm gonna be talking about the ugly, rambunctious, but honestly, somewhat hilarious and walking racial stereotypes and caricatures of black people in America themselves. Skids and Mudflap, aka the terrible twins from Revenge of the Fallen. Oh, oh, oh my God. All right, look, bro, I'm gonna be honest. I'm black. Like, I don't have this Miles Morales profile pick for nothing. You know what I mean? And you know, being part of the targeted demographic that these two hood boogers are stereotyping. I came into this video like fully expecting to absolutely despise these two characters. But uh, I was watching all their scenes for this video and they made me laugh a couple of times. I'm just keeping it real. They also had way less actual screen time than I originally anticipated to, but uh, you know, that won't stop me from putting these two statistics in front of the auditorium, bro. I'm just being honest. Anyway, I've been already talking too much in this intro, but just remember to like and subscribe if you vibe with the video, man. Peep the gaming channel and join the community discord. And uh, you know, let me know how you feel about the twins in the comic section too. But it's time to grab your snacks, grab Every significant other get comfy strap in baby because uh, this one might be um it might be shorter than expected but you know me it'll be another banger from the boy oh man oh ho, 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 man let me tell you dog i know you peeped my voice over intro for this video but if you didn't get the context at all then let me put you on i got you so skids and mudflap were deployed in shanghai but him to miss prime to scout out some deceptive cuck activity in the area honestly they were chilling at first take it from me these two were just vibing on the job i respect it but then they put up on sideways and uh let me tell you boy this barricade lookalike saw them and low-key did the dash on them he wanted no parts <laughs> bro automatically sense how annoying these two autobot degenerates were this man sideways was way out of the twins league though their ice cream truck was unfortunately far too slow to keep up with bro and they ended up fumbling the mission dog at this point the movie legit just started how did you already take an l of this caliber i know mudflap was heated though he walked over to skids and gave his own brother cte oh my god friendly fire bro what are you doing no wonder why skids's face looks like this later on in the movie mudflap literally slacked the cybertronian brain cells out of this man had bro looking like one of those wacky caricature paintings man oh my god now we gotta talk about when skids and mudflap got their iconic alt modes their dirty duo reported back to home base after the l that sideways unintentionally gave to them but the u.s military surprised them with new whips dog they put up on the two new city cars and immediately got the rizzing them up bro like jesus did y'all even ask for consent first at this point the dirty duo started mixing for over who gets to choose which car but skids got his lift back from earlier and literally <laughs> tossed mudflap away so he can slide in the green whips dms not gonna lie this is a w for skids but I gotta give them another cataclysmic L, bro. I thought they wanted a Hellcat to flex in front of all the bad Cybertronian women. What happened? The military cheated you two out, bro. I can never let that happen to me. It's just facts. I'm just, I'm just being honest. Fast forward to when the Autobots tried to get it back in blood for him to his prime. When Megatron rolled him into that... 
Cybertronian size blunt. He put Robo Jesus in the past tense. And what did the twins do to the Avenger leader? Absolutely nothing, bruh. Look at them just standing there being dead weight. We find out later that they can turn their arms into Glocks, bro. At least do something. Bro, the twins are the type of dudes that sit in the bottom of the leaderboard for fun. They literally only played in a match for moral support, bro. At least help your Autobots get an assist. Bro, just do something. I gotta get them yet another massive L. Matter of fact, whatever's <laughs> whatever's in that L counter, multiply it by 10, bro. Come on, what are we doing here? Contribute to the team, you freeloaders. It's not that hard. Bro, do you guys remember when the twins and Sam and everybody were chilling in a circle around the junkyard? Yo, I just remember this, but Sam needed somebody to read and translate some ancient Cybertronian dialect. But guess what the twins response was to him? They said they couldn't read, bro. What? No. You're already stereotyping us. The black demographic. And then you got the audacity to say you can't read? Nah, y'all are really statistics, man. What are we doing here? What's next, bro? You're gonna say your dad loves you too? So you don't know how to act in public. You two talk using ebonics and act like wannabe street thugs. And now you can't read? Dog, Scourge is right all along. All you monkeys are the same, bro. We gotta do better. <laughs> Yo, what is wrong with me? This this will probably be the video to get my channel shut down. Oh my god, bro. But y'all, man, go watch that Scourge video if you haven't seen it already. It was an Izzy Mandias classic. I'm just being real. But, yo, imagine if Barricade pulled up to the twins, bro. What would they do? Just think about that. What would they do? <laughs> yo, alright. Let me, let me chill before my channel really gets taken down. But in all seriousness, though, bro, these two are the least, like... <laughs> I'm gonna sound redundant here. But these two are the least serious characters I have seen in a very long time. Yo, I better not catch y'all being anti-black in the comment section, though. Y'all better leave the jokes to me only. If I catch you guys being weird, then I'm, I'm gonna hit you with the silencer myself. But anyway, let's get back on track. The twins put up to some Egyptian ruins to help Sam scoop the legendary Matrix of Leadership. Skids thinks he's Solid Snake from Metal Gear and gets to acting like this is a stealth mission. But Bumblebee said, nah. Bumblebee just straight up little bro skins nope. by literally walking into him while he's pretending to be Sam Fisher from the Splinter Cell series. While inside the ruins, the twins started throwing hands over a petty argument. They started Mario jumping over each other, slamming themselves on the walls. They were basically just giving each other brain damage the entire time. Bumblebee said, enough is enough though. Bro picked both of them up, slammed their heads together, and threw them outside. That's yet another monumental L for the twins, bro. Bumblebee just basically forced them to sit in the back of the bus, dog. I couldn't believe my eyes. Yo, this is wild, bro. I need to chill. All right, this video can't be all jokes and terrible moments from the Dirty Duo. We got to end this thing with a little redemption art. Devastator spawned in the match and proceeded to slurp up literally everything in the area, including Mudflap. Dog, Devastator is really a pyramid-sized Dyson vacuum, bro. Somebody stop this thing. Everyone decides to relocate under Devastator to stay hidden. But all of a sudden, Mudflap bursts out of Devastator's eye and starts to punish him. Mudflap started getting flung around, but bro finally turned into a shooter and started blasting Devastator's dome. He was doing some damage too. Like, okay, I see you. Skids climbs up Devastator's leg and the twins low-key started finessing, bro. They were putting in that work. The twins eventually called each other on some crane wirings but right when everything was going well mudflap accidentally shoots skid straight into his face bro really initiated the friendly fire modifier dog what is wrong with you i gotta get them yet another colossal l bro these are trash well <laughs> that's certainly a spicy video but you made it to the end like the goat you are but yeah man i hope you enjoyed this one me personally, I'm still 50 50 on the twins. I'm like, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, on one hand, like, these dudes are like absolutely hilarious. <laughs> I'll be I'll be honest, like, they're funnier than I remember it in this movie from, you know, watching it from so long ago. But on the other hand, you know, they're essentially walking, talking racial stereotypes, man. It's actually kind of depressing if I'm being real. But yeah, bro, what did you think of the Treacherous Twins? <laughs> Let me know in the comment section below, man. Talk to me. Shockwave's second video is probably going to be coming next. Unless I do a surprise guest. But uh, if you're new to the Izzy Man D's portion of YouTube and like the vibes I got going on around here, then, uh, you know, stick around and subscribe, bro. And you won't be disappointed. With that being said, you know, you know, you know, you know me. I'm Izzy Man D's, bro. <laughs> I'm the local chef around here. But always uh, make sure to eat food, stay hydrated, and be nice to people, bro. It's all I ask, man. But yeah, dudes, you have a good rest of your day, and I'm out of here.